Hello and welcome back everybody. My name is Seren and today we'll continue on our mission for the Omni Sire at Warhammer 40k Mechanicus. So, let's get the ball rolling and we have some Xenos to slay. Yep, the Omni Sire's work is never completed. I require your intervention with the next stage. <laughs> let's see. What are our next missions? On Videx, we have to install a system of Cox Vox, Vox casters to transmit prayers throughout the tomb of Agolek. Videx believes that this will dampen the Xenos taint in the tomb. We will get an energy enhancer. <laughs> now, at least know what it is. We get two energy damage for one round. Nice. We get a ranger, which, if I recall correctly, this is another troop. And we get Blackstone. And on the Killing Jar, Tech Acquisitor Skevola wishes to begin her research into the secrets of the Necrons and has asked for specimen of the enemy to be gathered from the tomb of e what? Acropis. Alright. We get the Creatio, Creatio Mechadendrite, another heal, the Omni Specs, and Blackstone. I actually think I want this for the Creatio Mechadendrite. And we will launch this mission. So let's do it. And we need we can take the can of the craft for an extra damage here. Tech Acquisitioner Skevolar, I ask you on this mission because of your experience with surveying alien artifacts and organisms. And so the heretics of Stygius 8 can plunder this world for its secrets. Your assertion equal false. If objection, concern, offense, go to a different mission. <laughs> and leave you free to do as you will. A dereliction of logic, Skevola. Mesherians 16.4. Watch your brother, for his sin of heresy is thy thin of tolerance. <laughs> oh, this guy is such a fanatic. Silver where Tenebris Evaluation commences, plus wonders, plus opportunities, plus secrets. Rare chance for discovery, intelligence on Xenos. Must not fail to exploit. Uh, he's gathering tech. Or she. Alright, she. The logic of your enthusiasm eludes me, text acquisition. My emotional co course return only peril to our missions, personal and the threat of the awakening Xenos. Therefore, I am on this mission. My role equal gather intelligence, seek truth, return to human comprehension. Dictates of mark, math retrieval, gather knowledge for the good of all. For the tech acquisition, or uh, I hope I pronounce this correctly, the te tech acquisition is actually here to gain the knowledge, to search for new knowledge, while the others are just hating new knowledge. And every the only thing which is good and proper is old knowledge. And how are you about to go? Uh, and how are you to go about this, Skevoler? Field operations in person equals suboptimal. Sending tech priest instead is optimal. First objective: gather field specimen for study. Location: tomb of Acropis. Commence immediately. <laughs> Let's do it. I would love to get a uh, new weapon which has actually some punch to it, like the uh, Phosphor Serpenta. Given the reports of the Tomb of Acropis, there should be plenty of samples in there for you to collect Magus, of course, but first you have to kill them. <laughs> My talents equals dissection after the fact. I leave the location, identification and executions to your tech priest, Magus. I trust it will be worth the effort, Skevola. These are no mere labor servitors we are risking on these tombs. These are men and women, follow fellow devotees of the cult Mechanicus. Agreed, Magus. Valid point raised. Ensure human corpses are returned as well. Plus opportunity to study the effect of Necron technology on human flesh. I'm not sure this is what he had in mind. <laughs> Alright, let's start by going here. Self-preservation versus curiosity. Conflict unresolved. Desires of knowing what purpose chambers served. The chamber ahead is lined with glowing green cylinders, each pulsing with power. The air is thick and greasy. The arc of static electricity leap from the cohort's extremities as they approach. This chamber is almost certainly extremely dangerous, but it's the only way forward. We can either study the Necron technology, shut it down, 
but just move slow and steady. Uh, we try to shut them down. Quick sinking Megas. When problems is six equal true, correct application of tech law equals always successful. All right, we get two cognition points, but we get one awakening increase. Because harmful renewed. All right, no harm, but we were slow. All right, all right. So we must go here. Oh, we have two glyphs. I actually want them, and I think we will not go here. Warning, our presence has been detected. Opportunity detected. Necron combat tactics, weaponry's capabilities eliminated. Studied. Required. Ooh. Brutal fight. A brutal gunfight. Two Skitari lie dead. Marks from Gauss Blast. So I can either... Oi, Oi, gosh. Yeah, my English. <laughs> we can expropriate. Or we can examine. I think we expropriate. All right, I get an awakening increase. But yeah, now full on gorge, and we will glyph. Uh, a single port designed for a Necron Canopec creature, extrude from black. Last thing, time we used the smiley face, this time we will use the, use the battle axe symbol. Plus three HP. Mm, I actually think I want the smiley face next time again <laughs> yeah extra necrons in battle nice yes exactly what I want speculation terms possess autonomous repair defense maintenance capabilities further study equal yes have them collected for me first in years the chamber head has suffered damage from the shifting of the landscape above Several dozen tiny beetle-shaped constructs are scurrying about industries as they repair the damage. So we can either ignore them, we can acquire them, or we acquire multiple of them. I think we will just try to acquire everything we have. Scarabs are not individual constructs, but resources of the tomb itself. The whole tomb is a form of necron construct. Ooh, nice. I think this was very worth it. Next thing, glyph. Kind of peck, we use the smiley face again. <laughs> nice. Me gusta. Alright. Let's see. What do we have here? Oops. All right, we have two Necron warriors, and we have to kill all enemies. Um, they are first, so I guess we will be a little bit backwards here. All right. Well, let's see. All right, here we are in range. And we can macro stubber him. Maybe we should first use the cognition point to reveal his stats. Ooh, good thing. Two energy armor and we have macro stubber. This is good. Oh, critical, nice. Now we move a little bit backward here and use one cognition point. Just moving back here. And the other one. Um, oh, he has two, two weapons, which is nice. We are using the macro stubber on him again. Ah, two damage. He's not not yet dead. Um, two to three damage. Uh, I zero to one. We might kill him. One damage. Yes. 
Ha! That, that's nice. Does he have the damage? No, he hasn't. So we will move here and scan this. Nice small black stone. Now afterwards we will move back here. And because we can, use this to reveal his stats. I should have used it on the other one. Damn it. And by the way, I think I, I uh, pronounce it wrongly. It's cognition point, not cognition point. Derp me. <laughs> Alright, we can add some servitors. Why wouldn't we? Can even use all four here. Just if something happens over here, we might get some guys coming in here because of these more Necrons in battle thing. Right. Yeah, yeah, hit him. Right, we got one cognition, uh, cognition. So we need to move here. Unfortunately, we can't reveal his stats, so we will just hit him. We move a little bit backwards, but on the other hand, he shouldn't attack us, I hope. Move here. And we'll hit him with the machine spirited weapon. Oh, nice, it reveals. Oh, 03 HP. We can kill him here. Two in three chance. No. Oh. Alright. Can't win it every time. Oh, right. Oh, there he is. Like expected. Unfortunately, I'm one too far away. And he's also too far away. He will just move forward. Blocking. Yeah, hit my minions. I really need to, to kill him. There yeah, hit him. Not a problem here, mate. All right, and you can... Oh, he's out of range, but I hope you can kill him. Machine spirited. Oh, no, he's not dead. How much does he have? Oh, one HP. Come on. Yeah, 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 repair him. And now I... Which was what's your statistics again? Yeah, energy armor. So for the energy guy, I think we will actually kill him don't want to risk it and this should kill him even though he was repaired nice the thing and the turn for him now it's our turn you move into melee here If he has not... Oh, funny, he running? Oh, he gets more! Interesting! I wouldn't have guessed. Let's hit him. I hope he has not too much of... Uh, 
physical armor here. Let's move up in front here. Now it's your turn. Two to four damage. I think you should move in a little bit because you're not doing so much damage. Oh, you're out of range. Yep. He does not have very high range. So let's just hit him, just to be sure. And get another cognition point. Not that we need it at the moment. But so we will move a little bit backwards here again. Yeah. I think we did that. Oh, critical damage and acid. Yeah, of course. They are doing acid. Almost forgot here. I hope he killed them. Yeah, nice. And oh no, he can't. He can't reach over there. We move here. And now try to hit him. Nice. Next one dead. And now you're moving over here. Because they might need you. And reveal his stats just for good measure. Alright, nice. He has no armor, which is very good. Because they have actually, I think, both of them have a shield spirit weapon. So, be machine spirited here. Bye. <laughs> nice. I guess that's called We Won. Mission, objective, finished. Or achieved. Circumstances evaluation confirmed disappointing. Necrons employed teleportation technology to achieve post destruction discorporation. Where do the remain go? So, no, we couldn't get any specimen. Oh, that's a pity. Um, take pigs. Maybe we can, can can analyze. Ooh, what do we get? A power field generator. Interesting. All physical attacks gain more damage for one round. Ooh, that's an interesting one. Mission complete. Yeah, we returned from the tomb. <laughs> Frustrated by the lack of samples. <laughs> Valuable data present, better than past. Totally a human, total of human knowledge increased. Mission conclusion, positive. I cannot say I support your conclusion, Skevoller. Beneficial conclusion, itemization follows. Necro discorporation, witness. Enemy construct destroyed, great. I think that's greater than zero. Necron combat performance evaluated. Chances of function in Necron available for dissection increase. My emotional cores are returning sensations of frustration and resentment, and I chose to acknowledge them. The lives of my tech priests are not there to be risked for the fulfillment of your desires, tech acquisitor. They are here to be risked in the to be risk for the acquisition of technology, learning, sacred knowledge. Your understanding equal approve. <laughs> Funny guys. Alright. They were not harmed, which is good. And we killed several guys. Success. We receive more Blackstone. 3% more on the increase ometer. And I guess that was it. I guess so. And because we didn't have used a canticle, we get another canticle. Nice. Very good. Very good. So let's see if we can upgrade our cohorts a little bit. Oh, good evening, everybody in Twitch chat. Thanks a lot for joining. And thanks a lot for Kemper for raiding me. And no, this is not Atlas Reactor. This at the moment is Mechanicus, Warmer 40k. And we will see what we can do with this guy. He's our engine seer, so our healer. So maybe we use auto repair, which sounds nice. Maybe we should actually use that. Sounds very nice. And he has one spot open. So he already has Curator Claws and a Macro Stubber. 
So, should we use a Sanctus Canister? Or a Power Field Generator? Or more Curatio Machine Dendrites? Or even an Omni Specs? I think I actually in lean towards an generator here. Power Field Generator because it uses um, recognition points. Let's see how it works. You now the other one, we also upgrade him. And he's our Dominus. So let's see. The attack protocol on the Zerval Skull might be actually quite interesting because he can kill any uh, Necron corpse before they teleport uh, so that they don't reanimate. So we will use that. Nice. And he again also has one capacity left. Uh, what should we do with him? Should we also give him a Curator Claw? Or should we give him uh, a power axe? I don't think a power axe would be good because he's our ranged guy. Mm, power field generator again. I mean, he also has the macro stubber. Or the, cura the curator claw, but I don't think the other guy needs it. All right. Good evening and see you around, Kempfer. Thanks a lot for stepping in. Hmm. Power field generator? A curator claws. What do you guys think? Or even a Sanctus canister? Oh, plus two damage on everything. Might be even more worth than. Actually, actually, this might even be better than the power field generator because he gets plus two damage to everything. Maybe I should use this one. On those. Let's unplug this one and also get the Sanctus Canister. And we have even one, even enough Blackstar exactly for one more upgrade. So either our engines here gets one energy armor plus two max HP, plus one physical armor, or just plus two max HP. Or our, where is he? Um, our Magus Jeremiah gets also plus HP, big max HP. The energy armor would be quite interesting. Or do we want one of these? No, I actually think I want to focus a little bit here. The plus two max, plus three max HP. Last time I got was plus one energy damage, and this one is the torso. Ooh, it's starting to look cool here. <laughs> okay, one rank four and one rank five. Magus Jeremiah on the fifth rank, and Mergus Maranius on rank four, which seems cool. And I guess, at least for the YouTube guys, this was it for this stream. Uh, for this video. Thanks a lot for stepping in and I hope to see you tomorrow. Bye bye.